on go. Quick shots by Blue, sinking in two for the Blue Alliance, three for the Blue Alliance. High arcing shots. We got four for Red, five, six for Red, six for Red. Berkner again lining up, lining themselves up. One, two, two more. Looks like clear advantage Red. I count eight to three. Three, two, one, go. Red with an early advantage again in finals match two. Repeat of finals match one. 31-0-16, up on a ball. Berkner coming in on the bar. One, two, three, and four quick shots for the Berkner Robotics Robo Savages on the bar. Ten pointers and 15 more. 25 quick points for the Blue Alliance. 32-0-1-6 with a lot of balls in the backfield as 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 Swamp Botics now in the back collecting the remainder loose balls already from the field. The field nearly swept. Berkner and 2Z Robo Savages tangling in the center. Berkner trying to get out as Swamp Botics begins their volley from the human player. And here they go, bang, bang, bang. That catapult puncher device hammering those balls across the field. 32-016 collecting from the backfield. Trying to take every one of those stray balls and turn them into points. Out in the center, Robo Savages and Berkner competing for the last remaining rebounds on the field. Berkner fighting with the Robo Savages, drifting across the field. So, refing. We got 26 seconds left on the clock. Let's see if we can get this elevation again on the real-time score. Red leads by 15 points. We're canting to the side. They may not make it. Can it make it? It looks like it's not four inches off the ground, leaving an opening for the Blue Alliance. Blue unopposed on the field. We got five, four, three, two, one. And this is going to come down to the wire. The elevation fails on the Swamp Botics machine so close. We're going to have to wait for the final scores to find out. It was close on the board within 15 points on the real-time.